<clears throat> Good evening, ladies to the gentlemen, to the boys, to the girls. This is your host, this is your guy, DLG Repping. And um, I've got a couple of um, transfer updates. And this is um, from my context that I've written down tonight to talk about. But first and foremost, um, I want to say thank you again. Um, if you're watching, thank you again. And just keep watching. So good evening, as I said. Or is it good morning or good afternoon, wherever you're watching around the world. Hope you've had a um, good day today. Another fabulous day, should I say. Well, um, we got um, Manchester United here. They have signed Donny van der Beek for um, 35 million plus the add-ons that will come with it. So it will total, obviously, 45, 40 million pounds. And... My first bit of context is about um, Everton, who have agreed a £25 million deal to sign Watford midfielder. And he goes by the name of Abdullahi de Khoury. Now, that is a very good signing for them. That is a very good signing. I think Everton fans will be pleased with that and excited. So, they won't have any complaints. So, do bear with me. I've got a bit of a sore toothache. As it says in the title, highlighted in yellow. Everton agreed 25 million the quarry deal. Everton have agreed a deal with Watford for midfielder Abdullah the quarry that could be worth up to 25 million. For me, he's worth every um, penny. He's proven in the Premier League. He's a box to box midfielder, strong, athletic, um, tenacious, neat and tidy on the ball, good in the tackle. He's everything what a modern day midfielder should be. And fitness levels are immaculate as well. And he's the sort of player that will get into Arsenal's midfield. And I'm happy about and well, I'm happy to see him in the Premier League. I'm happy for Everton. And um he'll be a good fit for uh, um Carlo Ancelotti's own project there. So reading on. Negotiations between Everton and Wat Watford reach a successful conclusion on Wednesday. The 27-year-old Frenchman will have a medical before signing a four-year contract with the Toffees. Italian manager Carlo Ancelotti is also closing in on moves for Real Madrid's James Rodriguez and Lazio's Brazil international Alan. So, wow, that's a good window, you know. Everton's midfield, you can't uh, make any complaints. That is a good midfield as you would possibly get in the Premier League and do it. Dark horses for the top four. So you've got to keep a close eye on Everton this season. And um, Carlo Ancelotti, um, he's a man with winning pedigree. One-to-one um, -one tactician, one-to-one -one, uh, management is um, superb. Tacti tactically unique as well. So he gets results and well, he's going to make Everton into a footballing force in the Premier League so keep an eye out for them dark horses for the Premier League for me and um, Abdullah De Corey will soon become an Everton player so moving on from Everton my next bit of um, context is Manchester United and they have signed with Donny van der Beek this is an um, exceptional top top class footballer who plays as an attacking midfield player arrives late scores goals he's in the mould of um, Frank Lampard and um well, he's in the mould of Frank Lampard in a way. Mould of Paul Scholes, Frank Lampard type player. And um, Man United fans have always loved them sort of players, you know. And Van der Beek will be instantly welcomed in, with open arms by not just 67,000 Man United fans, but complete millions, complete millions and millions of Man United fans up and down the, the globe. I mean, it's an ideal signing for Manchester United. And... Um, I ask Everton fans how um, happy you are about Abdullah Dukhuri. Give us your thoughts. Give us your um, yeah. Give us your um, opinions on Abdullah Dukhuri and Manchester United fans. 
give us your thoughts and your opinions on um, your new signing, um, Donny van der Beek. Yeah, just leave it in the comment section below. And um, I'll have a conversation with you. Also, before I go, um, make sure you um, smash the thumbs up like button and um, what will mean the world to me as well, yeah? As much as I'm getting the viewers, I'm overwhelmed with um, the viewers I have. Just a little over 6,000. Do smash the thumbs up. I mean, yeah, do smash the thumbs up like button and smash my subscribe button left, right and centre. I want to see subscribers all over. Smash it hard and passionately for me, yeah? I need all those. I need as many subscribers as possible. Tonight would be nice. Tomorrow morning. Just keep um, smashing my subscribe buttons. You viewers, like I keep saying, encourage your friends, encourage your f relatives, family members to subscribe to my channel and myself, DLG Repping. And um, I'll be back tomorrow morning. Or no, maybe not tomorrow morning, but I'll be back tomorrow afternoon with more um, up-to-date football context, yeah? And... Um, I hope you have a good night, sleep, yeah, and make sure you rest well. I'll tell you something, tomorrow's a new day, and um, I wish you all the best for tomorrow and every other day, every 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 other day as well, should I say, or every day in life. So, I'm going to wrap it up and say thank you for listening, thank you for watching, thank you for putting up with me, and... Um, yeah, again, it's peace, bliss, and love. Good night, and um, rest well. From your host, your guy himself, DLG Ripping. The main thing is, yeah, as much as I want to see comments and driving and thumbs up going berserk, yeah, I want to see subscribers going more than berserk. I want to see it going wild. So subscribe to my channel, please. Thank you. Good night.